Giant football. Yo, guys. Today, we have my FIFA 18 starter squad. So, please hit that like button and subscribe. If you want more of these, um, then just tell me in the comments. But Liverpool player rating predictions will be up tomorrow. Let's get straight into this video now. First on the list, we have the man in between the sticks. And as you can see, I am going down the Calcio R route. And it is going to be Donnarumma. Now, I loved him in FIFA 17, my favourite goalkeeper. Hopefully he can continue that into FIFA 18. Um, but his base card already looks pretty good. So hopefully he can get a couple of informs. That would be a really good good card to use next up we have Dalbert as you can see with his player pick he was at Nice OGC Nice he was a 74 rated card at the start of FIFA 17 and he, then he got upgraded to a 77 and I predict another upgrade 79 but 92 pace 74 defending 75 physical and 81 dribbling that is a really good left back card pretty underrated as well I'd advise you to use that as one of the best Kelsey R right back, left back, sorry. Now we have Tonelli, uh, the centre back from Napoli. Uh, yes, he didn't get an in four, but he was injured for a little bit of the season, but still good pace, decent defending, decent physical. I am definitely using him at the start because he'll be very cheap. Next up we have Koulibaly, a little bit more expensive, but still. Really good, really, really good pace, really good defending, really good physical. I don't know how he's still only an 84, but I guess his shooting is really bad and his passing is really bad and his dribbling's okay. But if I can get my hands on that card, that would be a really good card to use, I think. Uh, in at the right pack of position, we have Karsdorp. He was at Ajax, I think, was it Ajax? Uh, anyway, but he has transferred to Roma, and they are going to have a pretty good season, I reckon. Uh, he's going to get an upgrade to about 79, 78, and good pace, good defending, and really good physical, so I reckon he'll be a pretty good right back as well. Next up, in the CDM position, I am doing a 4 one 2 one 2 uh, Formation and in the CDM position we have Milkonovic Savage. I think that's how you say it. But anyway, so he had a really good season. He was, I think, a non-rare at the start of FIFA 78 or something. And then he got some man the match cards and then informs. And he was on his way. I reckon he should have got a team of the season. But that's a pretty good card. It is a 70 club. I know it's only 70 club, but if you upgrade the pace like 75 and the shooting up to like 76, that would be a really good card. But CDM, I think it's pretty good. Next up, we have Cam Bernadeschi. He was a right mid, but he played most of his games as a striker or a cam. Uh, he will be at Juventus. A little bit of a mistake there. But anyway, so he will be at Juventus and... I don't know where they've been playing him, uh... I think they're playing him at cam, but they may be playing him at right mid, and that's a pretty decent card for a cam, not as much as a right mid. As I said, we have the right mid in this team, and it's Jose Callahan. He had a pretty good season. He did get the team of the season, the uh, team of the the knockout stage one, uh, but eight, 92 pace and 84 dribbling. But 79 shooting, that is really good because not many wingers have really high 80 shooting or something. Unless, you know, you're Messi or Ronaldo or Neymar or something. Next up we have El Shirawi. Uh 88 pace for him. We thought all his career was over and stuff when he moved to Roma. Uh, he's getting a little bit older now, but that's not stopping him from scoring goals and getting back into the starting 11 but that will be just one of the cheaper cards just to bring their coinage down a bit but no not too bad next up we have Belotti so I did want a bit of a stronger striker because the next striker we have as you will see soon uh is not as um he's more pacey than physical and I want a physical striker up there and he's got 
he's had a pretty good breakthrough season as well. And I reckon he'll be 82. He might be 83 or 84, but I think he'll be around the 83, 82 mark. Uh, good shooting, good physical, good pace. Not as good dribbling, but still, I really like him. The last man on this list, we have Alejandro Gomez. Uh, another left winger being converted to a striker. So we had Mertens, Gomez, Balder Diaw, and a couple of other ones. But I don't know what Kelsey will have done with left wings to strikers. But they've all gone to a striker, and they've all done really well. Uh, Gomez, I would get over Mertens because Mertens will be really expensive, uh, probably about 70 or 80k at the start of FIFA. He'll probably be like 200k or something. Uh, but we're talking about Hundred Gomez, 90 pace, 89 dribbling, and as I said, he's a bit weaker and Bellotti will probably get be getting in more shots than Gomez, but still, he's a really good striker. And with him, he is the last man in this video. So, if you haven't already, would you please hit that like button and subscribe. And yeah, guys, I'll see you in the next one. Keep it real and peace.